Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video tutorial, I will explain how to get the selected drop-down value into a label element using a Razor component in ASP.NET Core Blazor application. Let's go to the contact page. Now let's select grapes. So here we got the grapes. Orange, apple, kiwi. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. Before continuing this video tutorial, I sincerely recommend please watch my previous part 1, lesson 1 and lesson 2 tutorials. Now in this lesson 3, whatever the user selects the drop down value, I want to display on the label element. So first let's add one label element here, instead of label I am adding one bold tag. After that, I'm adding on simple select option element, which is our drop down list. Option, let's take this as a fruits, uh, apple. Copy this one. Apple, banana, kiwi, grapes. And the last one is the orange. Just for the remote purpose, I'm adding only five options in this select element. Now, before implement the selected value display on this bold tab, first we check the basic output how it looks the designing part on the browser. And these elements I have created in this contact.razor component, which is our contact page. Let's run this app. And here we got our the default output of our application the contact page i have created the select option elements so here we got the contact component here which contains one header tag and one drop down the select option elements which contains some list items apple banana kiwi grapes and orange now when a user selects any particular fruit name for example grapes i want to display that selected value on the bold tab which you have added here so for that first display a variable here the string variable display fruits is equals to empty let's end with this colon after that i'm adding this let's copy this one the variable name i want to display the whatever the user selects in this bold tab at display fruit now let's bind here at bind is equals to i'm adding this display fruits variable name that's it now let's check the final output i'm running the browser again let's go to the contact page now let's select grapes so here we got the grapes orange apple that's it in this video tutorial i have explained how to get the selected drop down value into a label element in asp.net code Razor app on razor components